Hello as always, it's your friendly YouTuber Reef and today I'm going to show you guys what to do when your video corrupts in while recording your gameplay. So I use Bandicam to record and sometimes due to my PC's age and the fucking heat here in South Africa, my PC randomly freezes while recording. So I have to re hard restart it because there's no way to control delete and so my recordings get a bit corrupted, sadly. So with the new, the latest version of Bandicam I'm currently uses, every time it restarts and I open up Bandicam again, it allows me to repair a video file, but I do end up losing some time. Um, for example, this is my Metro video I was recording, and it seems to work fine, but let me just get it up there, make it a bit smaller, but when I try and skip to the end, it doesn't always work all that right. I oh, know, this is the wrong video. Oopsie, my bad. Ah, uh, here it is. Here's the right video of my fat. Okay, so this is what I was talking about. Just ignore the previous one. Anyway, so this is a video. I uh, didn't want to full screen it. Come on. Okay, just move a bit. Sorry about that. Okay, so I can't really skip. If I try to skip, the video just freezes. You see that, right? So it's, it's corrupted. 11 minutes 17. Quite sad. Um, but it fixes the file as soon as you open Bandicam again. And we're using bandyfix.exe, which gives you a lot shorter but completely working file, which is fucking awesome, obviously. So, yeah, we have that. The other problem is obviously your audio files also get corrupted. And now this is where this whole thing comes in how to fix your audio files. Let me just show you, this is the game audio file itself, it doesn't play, doesn't open, doesn't work. Okay, so what you do is you open Audacity, right? Just waiting for Audacity to open. Okay, mine is in Afrikaans, but I'm going to explain this in English. So you go to File, and then you go to Import, and then you choose Raw Data. Okay, uh, so then you go to the file you want to import, um, it should be this one. Um, click open. It's going to ask you then for some information about the data. Um, I know that my things are recorded in 16-bit PCM and I'm using the small little Indian and it's stereo. Um, I'm choosing to start at zero bytes and I want the whole thing imported and I know my stuff is recorded in 48,000 hertz. So then I just choose click on um, food in or import and then it just imports the data for me. It just takes a while to do this because obviously it's a fair bit of data. Um, then I have my audio file right in front of me. So if I click play, it works. But you did notice there's a small popping sound in the beginning, right? So what you do then is you choose your magnify thing. You magnify the bar a few times. You go back, yeah, quite a fit, bit more. Uh, then you go back to the beginning, you choose the normal editing tool, play again. Okay, fine. So there you hear it. I'm just going to select the beginning of this file, the entire, just the beginning. Go to Generate, um, then choose Silence, then say OK. So now, if I choose Play, there's no popping sound and the rest of the game audio should work fine. All you need to do then, obviously, is just export it again and just replace the file you just worked on. Just go like that, wave, wave, save, yes, I want to overwrite, okay, fine. And there you go, your audio file is now fixed and then you can actually work with it. So if I, no, I don't want to save any changes. So if I click on it now, it should open. Good, awesome, great. So that's basically how you fix your audio file. Anyway, let me know what you guys think of the video and if this helped you anyway, I'm fucking grateful for that anyway. Bye.